It's a story known all too well. Jesus came alive and he was born in Bethlehem. At St. Mark's Church, they are remembering the reason for the Christmas season with a prayer service called Lessons and Carols. The service recalls readings from both the Old and New Testament, while a choir sings songs of the birth of Jesus. It's a reminder of the salvation history, what God's plan is for you and for me. Monsignor Kieran Harrington, the head of DeSales Media Group, presides at the service and delivers the homily. Afterwards, the parishioners experience their own form of the nativity through the lighting of the tree and the creche. And just like the Magi, it all started with a star. We start at the top and work our way down. Carl Olivieri is the mastermind behind the beautiful manger scene. A self-proclaimed lover of nativities, they have been his favorite Christmas activity since he was a child. I've always loved them since I'm little, and I just, that's what, that's what happens. But with handmade figures and dozens of angels, a nativity like this one doesn't just happen overnight. Unlike other trees, this tree took over a week to set up. And that's because it was inspired by the tree at the Metropolitan Museum of Art. It was beautiful. The tree looks so beautiful. But for the younger kids, an even bigger surprise awaits them during the lighting ceremony outside. I was so surprised. Me too. And as the tree lights outside twinkled in time, a parish Christmas season has officially begun. Reporting for Currents, I'm Katie Angusser.